Well, the question that I just want us to reflect on before we move on to the next point is, are there sins here at Stony Hill? Are there sins in your own life? And I hope every single one of us, although we're not saying it out loud, is saying, yes, of course there are. Of, of course there are sins in this church. Of course there are sins in your life. How could it be otherwise? We're foolish to think that, yes, God liked Israel despite their sin, but he liked Stony Hill because we're really great people after all. How foolish we would be. God loves Stony Hill despite the fact that we are sinners. Only God is righteous. Right? Righteousness is living by a righteous rule and then carrying it out. But in my own life, I, I want to do what God says, and many times I don't do it. I wanted to be nicer to that person than I was. I, I wanted to think better thoughts. I wanted to keep back that word. I wanted... I, I can't be the only one who doesn't live up to my own expectations of me. I'm not righteous. You're not righteous. That's fine to admit. That's, you have to admit it. Because once you admit it, you say, well, what's the hope for me? Jesus Christ. The hope for all of us unrighteous people is Jesus Christ. 